What's up everybody and welcome to you all today I'm gonna be showing you how to install all sex Yosemite on VirtualBox on PC and by that you could enjoy the OS X and all the applications coming with it such as Xcode or any other application in the App Store so for that go to Google Chrome then go to virtualbox.org and there click download VirtualBox 5.0 my case for Windows click this link I already downloaded it so I don't need to download again now go to the link in the description for the Yosemite ISO file click download and download anyway now if the first link did not work choose the other one the alternative one now close these things after downloading and go to VirtualBox press new and name it Yosemite 64-bit next and uh, I'm gonna choose 5 gigabyte of uh, memory size till the end of the green line click next then create a virtual hard disk now VDI dynamically allocated and then I'm gonna choose 40 gigabyte of size create now go to settings go to system uncheck enable EFI in the display uh, smack this thing all the way up and in the storage in the empty thing click this little button then choose virtual optical disk file and choose the file you downloaded now before we boot this thing up you should know that the Mac OS X does not work on has will based computers so what we will have to do is to close VirtualBox and go to the command prompt and in the command prompt you should type cd um, space then go to my computer c um, program files oracle then drag the VirtualBox file to the command prompt press enter then copy the command you will find the description but before that you should replace the VM name by the name you set so in my case Yosemite uh, oops Yosemite now copy this command and paste then press enter now close all these things cancel uh, and launch VirtualBox now let's boot this thing up here it is it's booting here we are now in this window you type dash V and hit enter and give it some time to load here we go now all this all these commands and stuff uh, that you see is regular stuff so if you see warnings or um, false commands or anything else don't worry it's a regular everything is going uh, as planted um, now we have to give it uh, up to one minute to it uh, launch the installation menu uh, yep almost done okay it is completed and now you should see the circle uh, mouse here it is and it will load us to the installation menu yeah, here we go uh, use English for this main language just wait a second uh, let's let's click next okay continue continue uh, agree now in the upper menu see utilities press it then choose disk utility and um, choose the first hard disk then go to raise 
and make sure that it is Mac OS X extended journal now name it whatever you want I'm gonna name it Macintosh HD um, HD and then click erase erase again and now it's erasing partitioning um, mounting disk and we are done uh, now you can see the Macintosh HD here uh, click uh, X exit and now choose Macintosh HD and click continue and now it is installing the Hackintosh zone on our hard disk that we created uh, Macintosh HD so we will give it uh, 16 minutes and I'll be right back Okay, so I'm back now for some reason it gets stuck on the two minutes remaining as you can see and what we will have to do is to click right control R to restart the virtual box and click restart all right it's restarting now as you can see the second hard disk is our it's Macintosh HD now here we type dash s space dash v space dash n and hit enter now give it some time to load alright it will um, run a bunch of stuff okay now here you type slash sbin slash fsck uh, space dash fy and hit enter it is checking files the volume all right the volume was modified now what you'll have to do is to type slash sbin slash mount and space dash uw slash oh I have made a mistake it is slash sbin slash mount and um, dash uw um, space and then slash all right now the same command again uw and space slash all right now we type cd space slash dot os capital o capital s then hit tab and continue with scripts and slash then hit enter now ls and hit enter all right so now you type cd space hackintosh dot zone capital z dot po then hit tab that will continue with um host script dot id little id now this id is different from each one of you so you could not take it from the video now hit enter then dot slash post install capital i then hit enter now it will run a bunch of things and uh, it will take um, some time till we get finished so we'll just wait till it is done okay
Now all these warnings all on stuff is regular so don't worry about that. It's not um, doing anything unusual. It's all usual, all as planted. And after this video I will post another video for optimizing the Zimity. That will be a um, signal video. Okay here we go. Now you type exit and hit enter. Just give it a um, couple of minutes till it is done. And after that we will um, continue the installation of the of the Hackintosh before we are done. Waiting for DSMOS. All right. Okay, so completed. Uh, now we'll just wait for the installation menu. Give it some time. It should pop up now. Here we go. United States, click continue. Continue US. Don't transfer any information now. I will not sign in now. You could if you want. Click continue. I'll skip. Uh, agree. Agree again. Type your uh, name. Uh, Alright. Choose the password. Or choose any password. And that's it. Click continue. Creating your account. Do not send diagnostic because it is not a real uh, Mac. All right, here is our baby. Now we are done, but before you could use this uh, OS X, you should give it uh, some time to load. And now there's uh, a message or a notification that will pop up telling you that you to do not turn off the virtual box just give it some time to update caches and um, things all right so for now that's it just give it a few minutes till it's done uh, updating the the OS X and that's it for now thanks for watching check my next video for optimizing the Yosemite peace